Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Bree, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be talking about a subject matter that is important, and I definitely think that it definitely should be talked about more, and that is Black Lives Matter. Now, we lost a another person under police brutality and I just wanted to make today's video just to talk about to just overall become knowledgeable and how we can help make an impact. I think when we look back on the black oppression we always come to first think of slavery and slavery has happened in the span of over 400 years and although the president signed the Emancipation Proclamation in 1863 to free slaves. Unfortunately, it just, something didn't click because we as the African-American race still are not free. And that's the sad part. We just lost another black life due to police brutality. And I think now than never, we need to educate ourselves on black oppression and just become knowledgeable. Hopefully we can spread that knowledge on to others. I think when you educate yourself on black history, it really paints a picture visually of what we had to endure as a race, what our ancestors had to go through. And I know our ancestors had to face struggles and adversities, but unfortunately in today's time, us African-Americans are still facing struggles and adversities. And I definitely have been taking the time out to educate myself, just looking back on history and just to catch up to speed to where we are now and just trying to wrap my mind and process all of it all at once. So one of the things that I have been doing to educate myself is to watch documentaries, watch movies, watch shows. And I wanted to talk about some of the movies and shows that I have been watching that talks about the African-American culture that I think really do a good job with with black culture so the first show is called dear white people it is a show on netflix and it follows several black kids going to the prestigious ivy league college so the show touches on issues of racism and other forms of discrimination so I definitely recommend you guys to check out Dear White People. Again, it is a show that is on Netflix. So the next show I wanted to talk about is Orange is the New Black. I think that is a pretty popular show because I always hear people talk about they're watching it or have watched it. But if you haven't watched Orange is the New Black, I highly recommend you guys to check that show out. It follows a lady by the name of Piper Kierman, I believe that's how you say her name. She tells us her life while she was in prison. Now, this is based on a true story, but of course on the show, they have made some episodes to kind of relate to real life issues. And the two seasons that I want to highlight where it definitely talks about racism and those issues that we face as African Americans are season four and season five. And it definitely has created conversations and talks on those subject matters. Okay, so the next movie I wanted to talk about is called Fruitvale Station. It is based on a true story and it is based on the life of Oscar Grant. It shows you kind of like his life leading up to his unfortunate death and he was killed by a police officer and Michael B. Jordan plays as Oscar Grant and Octavia Spencer is in that movie as well. I definitely think it is a really good movie to watch and to get into. 
I hate what happened in the end, but. So the next movie is called Hidden Figures. It is based on a true story of three ladies who helped the first astronaut launch into space. You see their journey on working at NASA and just the racism that they had to endure. Those three ladies were the pivotal point in what helped the astronaut launch to space and orbit around Earth. This is a great movie and it's personally, I definitely could say, in my top five favorite movies. If you want to know who's playing that movie, we have in the movie Taraji P. Henson, Octavia Spencer, and Janelle Monet, And I think they had a really, really good cast that played in the movie. So I definitely recommend you to check out Hidden Figures. Other movies that I wanted to highlight, but not get into too deeply because it would be a long video, are The Help, If Bill Street Could Talk, The Hate You Give, Freedom Riders, Just Mercy, Coach Carter, and so many others. So the next point that I wanted to talk about is how you can support Black. And I think the most important thing that we can do to help support, how we can support each other is just simply just be there for one another. I think when you strip away the color of our skin, at the end of the day, we are all humans and we all bleed the same color. And as I mentioned earlier to definitely educate yourself on black history, black lives matter, and just do what is right. I think if we see something wrong, we shouldn't just stand there. We should definitely take action and use our voice for good and speak up, sign petitions, donate. Any contribution is not too small. And I think most importantly, let's come together and be there for one another. Just not black race as a whole, but everyone. So I think those are all of the things that I have to say in today's video. But before I leave, don't forget to be kind to one another. And also in the description box below, I do have websites and resources that you can check out to educate yourselves on and to sign petitions. And I will see you in my next video. Again, don't forget to be kind to one another. I've learned that if we think negative, 